Hey there, this is your girl Candace Duff coming at you all the way live from a sunny South Florida. And I'm here to talk to you today about five reasons that every author should create a membership program. In a separate video, you and I will discuss what a membership program or a subscription box could look like. But now I want to talk to you about five reasons why every author, whether you do fiction or nonfiction, should create a membership. Reason number one is that it creates a separate stream of income from, for your book. We all know that books constitute multiple streams of income in and of themselves. It can be an ebook that sells for money. It could be a hardback book. It could be an audio book. It could be um, foreign rights, translation rights, things of that nature. Your book is a, is a multiple stream of income asset in and of itself. But if you create courses, if you create memberships, if you do presentations or workshops off the back end of your book, it can also be an additional or a separate stream of income that you can get from your book. So you should create a membership because that will give you a separate source of income from the materials that you teach in your book if you do nonfiction or from your book period, whether you do fiction or nonfiction. The second reason why every author should create a membership is that it creates steady recurring revenue. You and I know that once you sell the book, if you don't have any other books lined up in a series or if you don't have other ways to get income on the back end, you don't get any more income from the book once you sell it or once you sell the rights to it or whatever the case may be. So this is a way for you to get a separate stream of revenue that's steady and recurring because memberships are either sold on an annual basis or a month-to-month -month basis. You know, you might pay $25 a month for a membership or $85 a month for a membership, but, you know, whatever price the membership is sold at. And this, when each person pays you that, that's money that's coming in every single month on a steady basis. And you don't have to wonder anymore, where is the income coming from? Whether I'm going to have money to pay rent or mortgage or whatever the case may be. So it does create a, a steady recurring income for you above and beyond your, your actual book. Reason number three, it allows readers to learn your content in a different way. We in the entrepreneurial world call that different modalities. Some people listen, uh, they learn from reading your book. They can take what they read in your book, they can apply it, and they can do lots of things from that. Some people only learn when, they're, when they hear things. Like, I prefer audiobooks. I'm more auditory than I am visual. So I prefer listening to a book or whatever and being able to envision it that way rather than reading it um, and holding it in my hand, which I know is that belief for most writers because most writers you know, prefer to hold an actual book in their hands. I like to listen to it. Some people only learn when they when they when they have you know somebody coaching them or when somebody's speaking to them or when they're looking at a visual course. They're more visual and audio. And they they prefer a course format. Whichever way that your readers learn, they'll be able to do that with a membership because in a membership you can have videos, you can have audio files, you can have templates and things like that where they can actually interact with your content and they can learn what you're teaching them if you have a self help book or a how-to book, or a business book, teaching a system, they can learn this thing in several different ways in a membership because you can give them all those things in all those different ways in a membership program. Reason number four is it allows you to serve your readers on a deeper level. A lot of times authors you know, only have contact with their readers when they do book signings or if they happen to be on a podcast or if they happen to you know, do a reading or something. This allows you to interact with your readers on a more one-to-one -one basis or even on a group basis more often. Because when you have a membership, you get them new materials and new interactions on a monthly basis. So you're able to interact with them via email. You're able to interact with them if you want to in group settings. You could have one of the giveaways of your membership could be a reading every month or um, some kind of Zoom meeting or what have you, or you know, some sort of session where you interact with them more in person. Um, it could even be in-person meetings where you have, as part of the membership, lunches in different places or whatever the case may be. This gives you the freedom to imagine and to actually interact with your readers on many different levels. So doing a membership is a great idea for that purpose as well. And reason number five, you'll have a community if you create a membership program, a community of readers who are just there ready and waiting to buy your book. They'll be looking for your next product coming out. They'll be looking for your next course. They'll be looking for your next book. Um, they'll be looking for to interact with you and you'll have more rabid fans. I forgot which author it was. He's the author of A Thousand True Fans. 
I think it's Nick Stevenson, I'm not sure, but he talks about how you only need a thousand true fans in order to have a really good income. And this will help you get those really engaged fans who actually want to interact with you more often and who's actually waiting for you to produce something new. And that helps you to avoid releasing to the sound of crickets. Well, I hope you enjoyed my five reasons why every author should create a membership. This is going to be a series of videos about memberships that I'm doing this week. So I look forward to seeing you in the next video where we're going to talk about what a membership program or a subscription box could actually look like. You know, what could you put inside them? What could you offer people in a membership? What would that actually look like? We're going to talk about that more in the next video. If you want to learn how to launch a successful and profitable membership site, then go ahead and get this free guide given to us by Stu McLaren. The link is below in the comments. It's about 40 something pages in a major detail. So go ahead and download it. It's for free and you'll find the link below this video. All right. Take care. And I'll see you in the next one.